good evening all welcome to the o3 technologies uh, youtube channel today we are going to discuss about vendor creation process first question who is the vendor vendor can be person or organization who can provide goods and services to our company example material purchases services taken present we are implementing oracle application for the parashakti cement company parashakti cement company required materials from the different uh, vendors like uh, coal india or chemical companies and other companies then parashakti cement company will take the services from the like uh, electricity companies and service based company like advertisement or rental services and different services so parashakti cement company should enter the invoices should bill the invoices per monthly so first ap team or procurement team will talk together to the vendor and finalize the terms and the conditions and we will get the all details from the vendor vendor name vendor address vendor like gst number or vat number and terms and conditions they will provide it to us then procurement team will go and create the vendor master data in oracle applications prerequisites define the employee as a user procurement user assign the respective roles procurement roles assign the business unit taxes then you can log in with the procurement user go to home page go to home page go to procurement you can see the supplier icon go to supplier then you can see the dashboard which is a new functionality in the fusion to verify and take the action point here go to task pane you can see the manage supplier create supplier import merge as well click the create supplier take the vendor name like uh, arabindo farm if you take here arabindo farm you can you can take as a name give the spend authorized select the type as organization type if client like to see more tax organization types you can go on define under look up codes and select the india enter tax registration number as a gst or vat click create button when you click the create button system created profile name first means back end it will create supplier id database front end you can see supplier number this number is controlled by specify supplier number you can choose the supplier type like a manufacturing you can save it if vendor having the parent supplier which you are already created go and assign it then profile level we can control 
your vendor organization related to corporate financial profile you can select the business classification if required what are the products they are going to deliver it to us transaction tax income tax payments also you can control so go to address then create it then give the address as a hyderabad country india enter okay arvindo address okay high tech city right let me type high tech city real time client users will fill the all data and you can enter 5 lakh 80 state telangana okay right then choose you want to use this vendor address for purchase order process and making the payment and invoice or invoice and payment you can enable this one you can give the number any number you can give the number enter mail id then you can see the same so vendor profile must have the minimum one site nothing but minimum one address or n number of addresses you can have it so one address is mandatory then go to sites add the sites select your procurement bu choose the earlier address name that uh, that is default at purchasing pay save save then if you go to general you can control information then when you enable the purchasing option it is enable purchasing when you are procuring the material from the arabindo farmer you want to communicate the message by mail or none or printed you want to hold any new purchasing document for control you want to assign the shipping method like dhl lorry or something you want to do self building automatic invoice if you go to receiving you can use the three way matching standard receipt over receipt action you want to receive more than receipt more than ordered or not you want to yellow substitute receipts you ordered life i soaps but you receive the like santur soaps example for some vendors if you go to invoicing select inr as a indian rupee okay right select the invoice match option because of material vendor choose the three way pay group you can use the standard pay group is mainly to run the payment batches in future i did not define any tolerances price tolerance i am not assigning then select the payment terms like immediate or net 30 or net 45 
select the terms date basis to be considered invoice date, due date as a pay date basis, remaining are defaulting from invoice options. Go to payments, choose the payment method to default to invoice level as installment page. Go to site assignment, click the add symbol, choose the your BU name, select the where vendor to be shipped, communicate them where vendor to be sent to location, then assign the liability account. If you don't assign also, you are able to create a, okay, vendors. Go to prepayment. Assign prepayment. Save. So site assignment is a new functionality in the future. Save and close. Then go to contacts. Add it to whom you want to talk to the okay person. Give the Okay. Use the vendor number. Email ID and you can input the address, everything. Okay. Save, save under close. So when you create the vendor data, it consists of vendor profile or supplier profile and address, site, site assignment and contacts. Once you created here, you can see recently supplier Arabindo Pharma, earlier I created different vendor names. Arabindo Pharma, you can verify. You can edit also. In future, you want to inquire the vendor, query the vendor, go to manage supplier, enter Arabindo Pharma. You can see the vendor's information. Okay. Right. So first one I created today. Okay. Right. So vendor will available to create invoices in AP as a pay site. The Tarvindo Pharma will create in a, sorry will available in the procurement to create a purchase orders and a process for next level. Without vendor master data, system will not allow us to procure any material. System will not allow us to create any invoices and payments in the P2P process or AP model. So real time or implementation time, vendors we will upload as a master data through a B-day template. Once gone live, means implementation got completed, we hand over the instance to the business user. Procurement users will create a procurement related vendors. Non-procurement vendors like uh, Airtel or advertisement companies like non-PO based vendor will create by APT. But coming to real time, while creating the vendor master data, client will request us when I when I am creating the vendor 
new vendor when i am modifying the existing vendor any information i would like to go for the approval process then suggest the bpm approval in the fusion ebs ame approval creation of the vendor modification of the vendor end date to the vendor so these are all process we will be follow in real time okay so thanks uh, for watching the tv you can listen happily you can you can click the like button you can subscribe the our channel thank you